Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Joyce and in today's video I'm gonna be talking about how you can make an Amazon wish list your default wish list. And this might be sound a little bit odd for you, but it's not. Let's get started. Recently, I've been talking about how you can have an Amazon wish list, how you can share your Amazon wish list with your loved ones. And in today's video, I'm going to talk to you about how you can make an Amazon wish list your default Amazon wish list. I know that this can sound a little bit odd, but it's not. Okay, I promise. What I mean by this is let's say you have like 10 Amazon wish lists and you want to make one of them your default. So every time that you won't go to a product and select the button of add to wish list, you don't have to scroll and go through the other wish list, but just click right on the button. And you can change your default wish list even if it's not the latest one. So let's go to my computer now so I can show you how to do it. Okay, so I'm going to go to my Amazon account. I'm gonna show you how you can do this. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the list of my Amazon wish list. I'm gonna go to this menu and then I'm gonna go here where it says hello Joyce and account and lists and I'm gonna go to your lists. I'm gonna go and click see more. Now I have all my lists here and let's say I want to make Becky's wish list my default list because let's say my daughter's birthday is coming up and this is going to be the most used list during this month. So I'm gonna select this one and as you can see this is my default list and you can know this because it's the first one and it says default list. So I'm gonna go and click on this one and I'm gonna go and click on the three dots right here where it says more and I'm gonna click on manage list. Now you're gonna go and see the privacy. Now you're gonna scroll down and if you scroll down to the bottom of the list, above the button of the lead list, there is a default list checkbox. You're gonna check that checkbox here and you're gonna click on the save changes. The save changes button is really important so don't forget that one. Let's click on that one. And now you can see that Becky wish list is the first one appearing here on your lists. And also it is marked and it says the full list. So now I'm gonna go to a uh, product, whatever here, and I'm gonna show you what is the list that it shows like as a default in the product that I am choosing. Let's see. So let's say I want this doll and I want to add it to my wish list. If I go click here, you can see that this was added to Becky's wish list because it was the default one. Now I don't have to go through all the wish list here because this one is the default and it's the first one that appears here. And the Joyce wish list is also here, but it's in a different place. And that's it. That's how you will be making a list, your default list. If you're interested in you know how you can add items to your Amazon wish list or you, how you can share your Amazon wish list, there is a playlist that I'm gonna be adding right here. So if you wanna go ahead and watch those videos, so you can know more about how you can make and manage your Amazon wish list. And remember that in this channel, I make videos that will help you to grow personally, professionally, and in your business. So if you're interested in this type of content, consider subscribing so you don't miss any of the future videos. I hope this video was useful for you. And if it was, please don't forget to click on the like button and on the subscribe button down below for more videos just like this one. Thank you so much for watching and see you the next time. Bye-bye.